Okay, Artyom, I'll climb up there while you take the boat to the church. I'll call you when I'm settled. All right, take it easy. Break a leg. Huh. Here we go. Oh man, not those things again. Hello, birdie. I guess I have to get ashore here. I think. Maybe not. So the water looks uh, pretty amazing. Not too bad. Alright, that's the dead end. Good. I shall try to uh, get around. Oh, looks like you've been spotted. Artyom, there's a woman on that bell tower waving a rag or something. Please investigate. I see people at the church. None seem to be armed. We'd better try the open approach. Let's not fire first, okay? Okay. Our father, Salantius, has already started his sermon. Just enter the temple and see the light of truth. We are a peaceful lot. So please keep your weapons shield and welcome. Yeah, I don't trust this at all. Not one bit. Oops. Can I exit this uh, boat or or this canoe? I guess I can. Perfect. Heretic.
Guess we're getting the hell out of here. These weird people. Go up or down. Perfect. Got some shotgun ammo. Don't worry, woman. You're safe. Ish. Absolutely no idea where I'm going. Don't know if this is the right way. Artyom, I can't cover you when you're inside. I'm changing position to meet the woman and child. I know you can handle this just fine. Okay. Let's see up here. He's being watched by the other guy. so hard is it you boris you could walk me i can't wait any longer help me out um yeah good luck with that no i'm not boris sorry Going the right way? No idea. Right, some goodies. Um, no idea what that says. Shit, who the hell saw me? Oh, that guy. Alright. Oh, 
perfect. Hmm, there's nothing in there. Can I take this boat? Or... Guess not. Hmm. Shite. They saw me. Too bad. Oh well. It was fun while it lasted. They're all giving up. Perfect. I'm done. I give up. I can't handle this anymore. Just don't shoot. I give up. Don't, don't you see? Where the hell is that guy that's screaming that he's giving up? Yeah, get knocked out. Praise be to the starfish. <laughs> yeah, I'm knocking them all out. Just to be safe. I'm just going around in circles. I have no idea where I'm going. Damn it. We're talking about stealing or taking a boat. Well, there's two here. Guess I'll walk around till I find what I have to do. Yeah, use the boat suspended from a gantry outside the church. Yeah, what the hell, I was there. This one. 
I can't do anything with it for some reason. Maybe this one. Ah, stupid. I could have done this uh, stealthy. I mean, I was here, I don't know, 10 minutes ago. Alright, well, I guess uh, I'll be uh, going back. God damn it. My weapon kept jamming. Holy shit. That's something big. Very big. Uh oh. Was a close one. What the fuck was that? A whale? It's fucking huge. Yeah, you're telling me. Jesus. <laughs> the old man sent me out as a forward sentry. Told me that I was to sit tight and under no circumstances look for any action. So I just had a front row seat watching you there. And so you subdue the occupation forces peacefully with a holy cross and a prayer. <laughs> Anna has already reported on the cult. How about we trade places? I'd hate to come back to Moscow without even firing once. I was trying to win a girl over from one trader. Tough luck there. Why does everybody else get fun missions? The colonel does criticize you and all, but he gives you all the best action. Is this his way of showing affection or trying to get you killed? <laughs> Probably the latter. I've been dragged out of Stalking the furnace and sitting in a bog with a dumb spyglass. Here though, we do have a chance of finding some loot. There is this plane there. Just leave something for me. I'll have to stay longer, I suspect. Uh, flip it around. All right, uh, put that away. Have a look at, at this plane. shooting at. Oh, they're being attacked by a demon. Hold on, guys. I'll be there soon. 
first have a look around the uh, the airplane. I'll be there ASAP. Weapon modification. Four times scope. I think, think that's a bit much for this weapon. Uh, but how do I clean my weapon? Don't know. Oops, wrong button. Alright, well, I guess uh, that was it. Let's head back to the uh, to the train. Uh, if I can find it. Ah, there it is. Oh shit. Of course, my weapon is jamming again. Yeah, fuck that, I'm out of here. Bye. No radiation here. Piss off. There are lots of dead people here, that's for sure. There's no radiation anymore. <laughs> All right. Here's Artyom back from the abyss of NATO You're occupation. Alive. <laughs> Impressive after the horrors Duke told us about. Let's go. Dad's talking to Katya right now. They are so nice. Both Katya and her daughter. And Katya's medical training will come in handy. Thank you for the information, Katya. But there is one more question I need to ask. But of course. What do you know of the occupation forces? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't quite get what you... So, you've never seen any foreign army in this area? No, I haven't seen any army. But we haven't really been to any important places. I see. Hmm. Artyom, a moment. Sure. Artyom, stop by my desk once you're done talking to the old man. I've got something for you. Okay. Great job saving them, Artyom. Katya here has provided us with vital information. A mechanic called Crest is hiding in the port. His help is required if we are to fix the Aurora in the foreseeable future. Yermak can't handle the repairs alone. So once you're ready, go to the port and invite Crest to join us. When it get back ASAP, we'll have to decide what to do about the fanatics on that bridge. Now we know for sure that the bridge is in working order. They crossed it last year when they got here. Well, at least some things are clearer now. But still, so many questions. There might not even be any enemy forces around here at all. They probably garrison the key regions only. 
In any case, we'll learn everything once we reach Yamantau. From the top source. The Moscow government is essentially a local council, to put things in perspective. So, now we just need to figure out how to cross this goddamn bridge. Alright. I wonder if there even are any enemy forces. Alright, what you, you like got? Backpack? Is it comfortable? Can you operate stealthily with it? Sure. I have a present for you here. A Tihar rifle. Ring any bells? It's pneumatic, but it still pecks a wallop. Plus, making bullets for it is easy as pie, even in the field. Just remember to keep that pressure up. Otherwise, you might as well be spitting him out yourself. Other than that, it will never fail you. I did my best. So, bear it with honor. <laughs> uh, pump by holding by down R and pressing time. left mouse button. I have okay. a few ideas for improving it. Yeah, pressure is also falling, I see. Okay. Yeah, I never was a fan of the pneumatic weapons, but maybe we'll give it a try in this game. I'll see about crafting those uh, bullets he was talking about. It only cost 10... whatever. Something. Hmm. Alright, we'll see. Um, okay, you have to go that way, to the port. Hi, Artyom. Hi, idiot. Hello again, Artyom. <laughs> you did great out there. Or so everyone says. <laughs> in the meantime, we have dug in here. We have been waiting for the occupying forces. But so far, we have only seen winged and four-legged ones. <laughs> Our ecology seems to sit badly with them. <laughs> yeah, Some good luck with that. In the too. Whatever. Uh. There we go. Alright. Well, I think uh, I'm going to end the episode here, uh, guys. We'll find out what's at the port in the next one. As always, I want to thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.